What's up guys? We're finally here in the studio and I'm gonna break down to you exactly what mic I was using and what happened to it. This is the Rode Video Micro. I think it's a great solid choice for anybody starting out. It's 50 bucks brand new, but you can literally find them anywhere online. Let go, offer up, Effie Marketplace. You can literally find them everywhere for like 25 bucks. I'll definitely be picking up another one just because it's form factor. I think it puts out decent audio for, uh, you know, its price and, you know, what it actually is. I have a phone rig. I think it's great for my phone rig when I want to be mobile, when I want to go to Disneyland and not carry so much heavy stuff or anywhere where I don't want to carry too much. I use this thing. It comes with a little windshield, a little dead cat. So what had happened was there's this part right here, right where the 35 millimeter jack plugs in. That little silver part comes loose from time to time. So I have to put the jack in and then tighten it. Unfortunately, I was thinking I was tightening it. What had happened was I was loosening it. And then when I popped the jack off, it uh, fell into the hole. So I probably am gonna try and crack this thing open and salvage it just for the sheer fact of trying. Um, but I'm definitely gonna be picking up another one because there's not enough good things I can say about just what you're getting out of this little cheap mic. Onto the mic I do have now. I'm currently using it, so I can't really show anything. I'll probably get some B-roll of it that'll probably be playing right about now. So that's the video mic NTG. I can't say enough great things about it. I just picked it up. By far my favorite thing about it is the fact that it's got a zero noise floor. I can literally just not talk and there will be no noise, no hiss, no hum or anything. Completely silence. I love that. I think it pairs well with my other Rode products like my, my wireless goes. So I, I can turn this mic and put it mounted anywhere I need, which is just a great application for anybody doing film. I think it took the best parts of the video mic series that is popular with vloggers and YouTubers and some of the key components of the NTG series that is popular with mid-level filmmakers and combine them to make this great hybrid. It charges via USB-C. I think those are two big factors that I'm in love with. There's a railing system on it that lets you push it forward and backward, depending on if the mic comes into your shot, which I think is great because if you have a shot that's punched in more, you can push in the mic closer to your subject, which, you know, calls for better audio that way. I do love that feature. It was one of the things that people hated about the video mic go, it stuck out behind the camera. So you couldn't put it against the wall and try and get a, certain shots. It feels good that a company listens to its uh, buyers. I haven't really gotten an in-depth feel for it yet. I've just played with it here and there, um, but I probably will down the line make a video of how much um, this thing really impacted my workflow in general. That's about it guys. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Poof.